A horse at Turf Paradise Racetrack was put down after being diagnosed with a neurological strain of the equine herpes virus. The horse came to Turf Paradise along with two other horses in late January from Sunland Park in New Mexico. One of the three horses began to exhibit the advanced signs of the equine herpes virus. That is neurological disorder. The horse was not able to support itself, stand up. Since then, 31 of the horses at the New Mexico racetrack have been diagnosed with a form of the virus. Turf Paradise is under quarantine, but the live races and 1,700 other horses boarded there have not been affected. The other two horses are still in quarantine. Uh, they're checked every four hours, and by checked, I mean their temperature, their vital signs, things like that. Uh, there is one person and one person only that tends to them uh, that way to limit any possibility of the spread of, uh, of the virus, and they have been fine. They're acting normal. The virus can spread through the air and through nasal discharge on feed and other equipment. People aren't affected, but they can spread it to other horses if they come in contact with an infected horse. Don't use, use the same brushes, don't use the same halters, don't use the same buckets, rakes, you know, kind of they're all separate. You know, you want to quarantine them and then everything you do around them, um, you don't want to go back to other unaffected horses. A Turf Paradise official said they are taking every precaution. No horses in, no horses out. Horses that wanted to come in here to race, they cannot come in here until the quarantine is lifted. The virus is contained and not believed to be a threat to other horses. Turf Paradise is still open and working with the Race Commission through the quarantine period. Live at the Digital Desk, I'm Kendall Bartley, Cronkite News.